Welcome to Springfield Stadium. Jersey Bulls unbeaten this season in the league, taking on Chipstead, the Chips, who today are more like Pacers in their green and white top. Well, will they come here and gamble and throw all of the chips in? Or will they just try and chip away at this Bulls defence who've been unbeaten with six clean sheets in a row? Can Van der Vliet and another changed back four keep a seventh unprecedented zero today? For Chipstead, well, they've changed their side from their win at home last week. A bit of an up and down season for them so far. Play 13 with 13 points in the bag from those and sitting in 16th ahead of this game today. A side that were relegated last year and will be looking to come here as all sides do to make it a difficult afternoon for the Jersey Bulls. And it will be the chips to get us going this afternoon. Mr Lane checks his watch. And we're underway. Corner for the Bulls. Early opportunity to put a bit of pressure on Chel Pinchak. It's going to be a combination of De Santos and Cavallio. Kilshaw. Back again to Cavallio. Wants to get this ball in. He does. Far post. The header there coming in from Watson. Back and across. Flicked on again. Hines. And then cleared off the line. Looks like it may well be. And the shot comes in from Curtis. Claims and a handball. Still going. Tips over. Looks like it may be Escher Logan with the final touch. With the Bulls hammering chance after chance on the Chipstead door, but they just can't get it in. And it looks like it may well have been Escher Logan who just gets the final header turned behind for another corner. Escher Logan goes short. Cavallio covers. In it comes. Well, Van der Vliet is beaten to it. And then a push in the back. Now, well, referee points. Looks like a goal kick. A bit of a nudge there, nothing really in it. Out on the far side now for Kilshaw. Lovely ball inside to Santos. Can he square it? Hines goes near post, over it comes, far post, Cavallio. Oh, he just needs to get a touch. In the end, doesn't really expect it's going to come through to him. He does stab at it. But it's a goal kick. Barlow has got space in front of him and everyone's standing off again. Ashley Lokin just giving him space. Hines plays it 1-2. Gets it back now out to De Santos. Lovely play there, Carl Hines. De Santos into the box. Can he square it? He brings it in. Anyone there? Well, there is. And it's Lamont. Johnny Lecane. Gets it to Byers. Byers now. Pass Tia Muna inside to Gavallio. Can he square it? He can. It's gone off. Well, it looks like it hit Sheridan on the chest. And in the end, he steers it comfortably back. Oh, lovely little bit of play there, trying to roll it away there in the middle. Oh, it's Lacane. He skipped past two. Hines again now. Now Kilshaw. Shoot is the call. Doesn't do so. Wants some support. Byers is there. Johnny Lacane run there. You see the bit of difference he adds. A little bit of class that he brings. Cavallio goes for the shot, good save. Uh, it's the first real save that the chip's dead. Number one, Chel Pinchag has had to make. Goes full length, he's left, manages to get two hands, so it keeps it alive. Cavallio again. I wonder if he might just take it on with his left foot. Holding it up, Watson again. Cavallio should take on. Well, he decides to come inside and switch it across now, straight to the middle. This time, a really good save. Johnny Lecane, great sweep to Santos. Heads it back and across. The flag is up, it wouldn't have counted. It calls for a really good save. Johnny Lecane back the way, taken out again, but the play on it is. Cavallio's there, can Cavallio shoot? He does. But Joe Pincher is up to it. Not enough power in the shot from Cavalier. But McCain there. The creator again just gets taken out. And they break out. Hill breaking forward. Kilshaw getting back. Dispossessing. Now Hines has a bit of an overlap here. Hines clips it forward. Goes for goal. Hines scores. Well, the goalkeeper completely misjudges it. It looked like Hines was clipping the ball forward. More of a pass than anything. But he's chipped it to perfection, he's beaten Chal Pinchak, it's what the Bulls have been looking for, it's finally come 
The first goal, ironically, comes from a chip. It's Jersey Balls 1, Chipsnid 0. Carl Hines, the scorer. Goals for Jersey Balls. Number 20, Carl Hines. And then a rare excursion forward for him as well, but forced back again by Byers. The pressure Byers has won it. It's going to fall to Hines. Hines looks for the little ball to the Santos, the Santos now. Oh, and he blasts it over from the tight angle. Maybe he could have squared it to Johnny Lacane, who's bursting through the middle and looks like it's what he wanted. Last ball forward though, now comes the keeper, punches well. Cavalier brings it down first time, does well, skips around. Jordan Beaton deceived. Back in across to Santos, Ooh, not too far over. Good jump from the number seven. Headers on target, just can't keep it down. Everybody forward except Byers who stays on the halfway line and Kai is about mid park. Far post it comes, Watson, easy as you like. Elementary, my dear Watson. Nick Watson stealing in at the back post, a lovely delivery and nobody marks him. He out jumps, it looks like Simpson, and he places it past Chow Pinchak. Well, it was easy as you like. Luke Watson doubles the Bulls lead. It's Jersey Bulls two, it's Chipstead nil, and you do wonder now if there's any way back. Goal from Jersey Bulls, number six, Luke Watson! And it looks like there's been a yellow card portion. In fact, it looks like Maybe two. Oh, it's a Simbin for Hill. So Hill has been sent to have 10 minutes in solitary. And it's like Simpson maybe picked up a yellow for his reaction perhaps after the Watson header. Rinse repeat. And it comes again. Far post. Watson flicks it away. And then Cavalio on Eshiloka. And then Watson steals it. Now the Bulls. They've got four on two. Dos Santos through the middle. Surely he's cut inside, he needs to square it. Cavalio takes the shot from distance. Well, John the came there, Cavalio was ahead of him. Can't get it past Chelv Pinchak. And perhaps a chance to put this game to bed. Byers defends, does well. Has the Santos alone. And then a run continued by Byers. He wants it and he's gonna get there ahead of Kelly. He squares it, well he doesn't, he goes for the shot. He goes for the side netting in the end. But a good run again, and that's what's happening now. As Chips is start to try and get forward, Barlow and Byers are getting forward for the balls. Barlow gets there, big up and under. Sheridan pushes well, straight through the back of the Santos. And Watson puts it out, and that is it. It's all over here at Springfield Stadium. The Jersey Bulls have defeated Chipstead. The goal's coming from the chip from Carl Hines in the first half to give the Bulls the lead. And then, with a header at the far post, elementary from Watson to make it 2-0. And that's how it finished. The Jersey Bulls run out winners again at home today. Chips are defeated, the chips are down and they are out today. It's Jersey Bulls 2, it's Chipstead 0. Another three points for the Bulls, and they will get to go again next week when Nap Hill are the visitors. Well, it's been another good afternoon. Really good, solid performance. 13 unbeaten. The Bulls march on. Van der Vliet, seven clean sheets. We hope you've enjoyed watching it. Until next time. <laughs>